up again. I need to be reminded of that every time I drive the outside. They come from regions of the Gobi Desert, uh, uh, China, Mongolia, Russia, and uh, over there it gets very extreme temperatures anywhere from negative 30 in their winter months, all the way up to 120 in their summer months. That's why they take that appearance twice a year. So they know winter's coming and we don't like it much. If you were to continue to go down that road, we get lots. All of our savanna animals from Africa are located right down there, and then it will bring you into the back areas of the savanna area, as well as the beautiful forest area of Africa. So if you look over your shoulders, you might be able to get a glimpse of Shabelsky horses, grubby zebra, the adex antelope over there. We have beautiful baby adex antelope that is out with mom and dad today, so go check that out. And through the tree line along the fence, you're going to see the reticulated giraffe. They are over at the giraffe feeding station right now. That will be going on until 2.30 today, if any of you want uh, to run over there. It goes every day from 10.30 till noon. of the giraffe to tail off of people's fingers. It's really cool to watch. Now, something unusual, camels and humans have the exact same number of bones in our neck. We all have seven bones. Can you imagine how big their bones have to be in order to uh, make that neck as long as it is? Over to the left, we're going to keep our eyes peeled. We might be some some more of all of these over here. I told you. Hold on one second. All right, sorry about that. We were getting the police. Are you getting ready? I guess they're going to watch for them. Over to the right. Sorry, I kind of got myself cut off over here. Over to the right along the back wall, you might see one of our lowland papers. Do I see them out? I do not see them out. If you can get into one of the Pentagon building, try to get in there. We have a baby lowland paper that was born on May 22nd. The baby is in there with mom. Dad looks like he's in there now. But the babies are adorable. They're funny. They're so oh, it's hard. Why don't you put that down? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 We have two different types there. We've got the Bokata tortoises as well as the African bird's eye tortoise. Uh, the Galapagos tortoise are actually the largest. Many of them are look like a couple of them are laying in the sand. The kangaroos are a little bigger cousin of those Bennett wallabies we were talking about earlier over by Wild Encounters. Now, when baby kangaroos and the wallabies are born, they're only the size of a little tiny jelly bean. And that little jelly bean baby will make its way about seven months, eight months, and start coming out a little bit more. By 12 to 15 months, I'm not going to want to be able to do it. At that point, that's what we no longer call them. Joey, they just become a full member of our mob. And that's what we call it, which is the blues. We are also testing by the field. This carousel, this is the largest hand coat non resort carousel currently in the country. Back in the 80s and 90s, so there you get an opportunity to see the beautiful murals that were being built. Plus, a hold on the top of that carousel. And this season, we had this done in 2006. You will actually be able to see some of the exhibits that we had here for sure back in 2006. So, this was one of them. They're just blocking and end up on a carousel ride. Right and we ask them why they've done that. They swear oh, they like some of their feelings they do. So, you know, maybe there is a little message. Um, uh, maybe. Now we are on a ride over. How do you go to the left side of our view? We do like to say left is best. It's the most for the kids and flash it for the children. Uh, so, uh, it's a great area to hang out for a while. Over our right hand shoulder, you're going to see one of our eastern black rhinoceros laying against the back wall there. This is Layla. She is a, one of our eastern black rhinoceros. Uh, these beautiful animals, unfortunately, are on the endangered species list as well. Now, back in uh, many years ago, there were thousands of these all over Africa and parts of Asia, the different types of rhinos. Eleven of those uh, types of species are extinct. 
a list of Kuma, there were less than 4,500 left of these Eastern Black Rats, right? Uh, and these have been the same as that protein. That makes up our human fingernails, toenails, and hair follicles. It's a protein called keratin. It's just like our nails and our hair. They're spun with those continually throughout their whole life. Um, so they would actually be better off if these uh, people believe that they can stay alive and they're safe from odor up, but no, unfortunately, they're hanging on that and um, poaching them to, to make money on their, the horn that they cut off their head. So there's over the the great side over the shoulder again. That's an animal boy. 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 If you go on the uh, side over here to the right, straight past the doorway, you might be able to see a uh, uh, brand new uh, baby cake. The first name is... Oh, Thank you. 
Oh boy! 